largest offshore fireworks show in the world. And this year's show leads off with a performance in just a few minutes from Team Australia, represented by Howard and Sons. Now, Howard and Sons Pyrotechnics are leaders in pyrotechnic innovation for a reason. From producing a fireworks display for the opening of Sydney Harbor Bridge back in 1932 and the Opera House in 1973 to winning silver in the Celebration of Life back in 2016, producing the highest quality fireworks in the world is what they continue to do best. They are making their fifth appearance at the Honda Celebration of Life, this fourth generation pyrotechnician team, so you know it's in their blood. They take pride in their international reputation for taking major events into the next league and they push those pyrotechnic boundaries. Since Howard & Sons was founded in 1922, they've taken home the gold medal in events such as the 2015 Da Nang International Firework Competition and the 2014 Shanghai Firework Festival. So welcome them tonight to the Honda Celebration of Light 2023. Now we know this is the first night of our three night event. You've got Mexico coming up in the Philippines one week from tonight. And the toughest job around is to judge which country comes out on top. So let's give a big thank you to our judges who are committing to be here every night and making that very difficult decision. Ian Quinn from Honda. We've got Harold Monroe from Post Media. Matt Meehan from Concord Pacific. Sarah Kirby Young, City of Vancouver. We've got Gary Gold from the West End Business Improvement Association and Scott Jensen from the Vancouver Board of Parks and Recreation. Thank you to all of our judges and stay tuned. Our show is going to begin in just a few minutes.